welcome back to my channel how are you guys doing i hope you guys are doing amazing sending positive vibes like always today as you can see by the title as you can see by the picture i am going to be reviewing the pr kit from luis torres and guys you have no idea how excited i am that i was able to get it because this thing sold out i think in less than like 10 minutes it was like 12.02 and I had already purchased it. So that's how crazy I am for this collection. I love Luis Torres. If you don't know who this is, first of all, where have you been? Because this guy is amazing. He does eyebrows. He's an expert on eyebrows. And he's a professional makeup artist. I look up to him and his work so much. I love how he is, the vibes. And I just love it. Um, one of my huge huge dreams is to meet him in person and take a class with him which i will be working on so if i do that if i ever do that which i know i am i'm going to be filming it for you guys if i can of course so i have it in my hands i cannot wait to do swatches to do the review and also this tutorial i did my face using the palettes the eyes using the palettes and then the lips using the lip glosses and stuff you'll see throughout the video so if you're not subscribed, don't forget to do so and turn on your little bell so you can get notified every single time I post a new video. And I just want to throw this in there. Thank you for the 500 plus subscribers that I have. I cannot believe it. I literally woke up one day and I had 500. Then I had like 510 or something like that. And I'm so, so excited. I'm so happy. So thank you if you are subscribing. If you're liking, if you're commenting, it really means a lot, guys. So now, without further ado, let's jump right in. So I do want to throw in there that I got these beautiful stickers. These are so cute. I didn't show it in the clips that you're going to be seeing in a second. But these stickers are so cute. I'm going to be putting them around where I have my makeup and stuff. So I had to throw this in there. So I want to give you the prices and show you everything, obviously. So the whole PR kit is what I have. It retails for $75. And like I told you guys, it literally sold out in less than 10 minutes here in US. Because in Mexico, you were able to buy it too. But I know that the site was crashing. That's how many people were on the website. That's insane to me. And I'm going to be talking about the palettes and the lip combos and all that. So let me show you the eyeshadow palette. So this eyeshadow palette retails for $24. We have mattes and shimmers, as you can see, or metallics, I should say. These colors look so pretty, and in a second, you're going to be seeing them swatched. Here are the swatches completed from the eyeshadow palette guys i am so impressed all of these tones are beautiful this is literally screaming fall winter vibes and i cannot wait to use this to create some looks and if i have to choose one color honestly i couldn't because this is all giving honestly i am very impressed even with these four that i just swatched for you guys you can still see that my fingers are still coated and the pigment on this is insane i could even swatch this two more times if i honestly wanted to like get into these colors guys these are beautiful the price is insane the pigment is insane like what more can you ask for next we have the face to face art palette this retails for 16 dollars and as you can see these colors are so beautiful 
like can you see how this packaging just shines like a diamond in the sun it looks so beautiful this is literally so elegant to me and i cannot believe the price so let me show you the swatches for this I'm going to show the double Leo lip trio which is retailing for $19 and the Torres lip trio which is also $19 I'm going to show you the shades and them swatched as well Okay, these lip swatches are beautiful i am obsessed with tones like this i love them if you already watch my videos you guys know that i love gloss especially right now but oh my god these are all so beautiful like i can't choose this is so hard because out of all this i like it all i cannot choose just one thing you know but oh my god like these are beautiful which one is your favorite let me know in the comments
moving on to the blush like bronzy color and then the highlight which is so pretty like you cannot tell me this is ugly because this is so pretty i like to wear my contour bronzer blush and highlight super soft i'm not into highlight that that much but i did put some on so you guys could see it so i'm using the palette of course this way sorry <laughs> and i'm going to take a brush from beauty creations like i've said in the past oh this one does have an actual number this one is called the rc08 so it's like on an angle i'm going to take the brown shade and i'm going to start placing this all around my face applying some right here i don't really use it on my chin anymore i don't know why I used to use it a lot and I used to contour a lot, but not anymore. I think I got over it. But I like to use my products softly, like I have mentioned to you guys in the past. If you guys like to use a lot of bronzer or contour, go ahead, you know, do whatever you like. But since I have something soft on the eyes, I want everything to be softer. And plus to me, like a really pretty soft skin looks really, really nice. But if you like to pack it on, girl, pack it on whatever you like. So to me, that looks really pretty. So now it's time for the blush, which I'm really excited about because these are my actual favorite kind of tones. I've noticed that I like to use like a lot of orangey, peachy tones. And this to me, it's like a pink peach, which I like. Maybe I'm colorblind, but that's the color I see it. So I'm taking it on the same brush. And I'm going to start right here to deposit most of the color and then bring it down. I like to tap in my product first so I don't move around my um, foundation. This color, 10 out of 10, guys. 10 out of 10. Like, I really like this color. He did a good job. Like, he knows what he's doing. Like, without a doubt, like, this color is beautiful. Like, if I wanted to, I could pack on some more, like I just did right now. But you're able to build it, which I really like. So you have time to play with it. Sometimes blushes, when they come out really, really harsh at first, like, you dip into it and then you go bam. It looks really crazy and it's really hard to blend out. But this, you could build it, which I really like. Those are my kind of products products that you can build obviously not a product that you can't even see the pigment something you know in between nothing crazy but nothing that's not pigmented you know what i mean i think you know what i mean so i'm going to add some right here i've always added blush right here like on the arch of my eyebrow i don't know i've been doing that for years and i've always liked how it looked obviously blend it out a little bit you don't want it to look crazy so now I'm going to use the highlighter. I'm going to take this tone right here. This brush is from Beauty Creations. This one doesn't have a, a number or anything. So I'm going to apply it right here. Oops, wrong side. And like, look at this. Oh my God. I don't use highlighter that much anymore. I don't think I've ever used it like a lot. But look how beautiful this is. Oh my God. I really hope that the camera catches it because it looks stunning so i like to apply some on the top of my arch and then some on my nose i don't like to do my upper lip because i feel like i don't have a huge upper lip and i feel like when you put highlighter at least to me on this part it makes it long and i already have it long so i don't want it to look longer you know what i mean so maybe i'm wrong maybe this is just in my head but i feel like it's right i don't know but i'm just gonna buff this in a little bit Connect it to there. And like to me, to me, this is perfect. I love how it blends. I love how it looks. In person, it looks, oh my God, it looks stunning. It's not too overpowering and I love it. I honestly love it. So now let me go ahead and choose the lip shade and show it to you guys. And this is the final look. What do you guys think? Let's talk about it because I want to give you guys my final thoughts and my final, final, final everything. So uh, this makeup look, 
to some people it might be super simple but i know there has to be people out there that have no clue on how to do a makeup look and i am always here to help that's why i started my videos i started my channel because when i started makeup nobody taught me i literally had to teach myself my mom has the most beautiful skin ever she didn't even need makeup all she wore was lipstick and mascara i think that's why i like mascara so much because i would i would always look at her lashes and i was like oh my god your lashes baby anyways that's beside the point um let's talk about the palette the palette oh my god this palette 10 out of 10 i am not even being exaggerated or anything this palette you have everything guys you literally have everything you need it does look used because i have been doing other tutorials for you guys this is the first one that's coming out but i have already filmed three or four so keep on the lookout for that this one is more of a softer glam that literally anybody could wear anybody could recreate and it's something that you could wear for literally anything if you want to switch up the colors go ahead that's the cool thing about videos. If you like other colors, you can go ahead and do them to whatever color you like. Now moving on to the quad, um, the quad, the face quad. A little, little, I'm sorry, my mind is like all over the place. This quad is so beautiful, guys. Like you saw how beautiful this looks. If you're barely starting out in makeup and you have a chance to buy this, it's a really nice quad. I can't even say anything bad about it. And if you don't have money to buy the shadows. You could even use these for shadows. You could use um, the brown and then use this as a cut crease. You can use this and this. You can use this and this. There's so many ways that you can use these four tones. So this is really pretty and they're super inexpensive. I am really impressed with the pigment, the price and everything. So if you have a chance to buy this, this is really good. And then when it comes to like the lip products, guys are all amazing. Like you're seeing the color that I have on right now it's so beautiful it feels really good it smells really good and then all of them are so pretty it's really hard to choose one so i'm not going to do it but like i said if you have money to splurge and if you want to get something you want to start building your kit beauty creations is really good they're super inexpensive and their products that they have been bringing out are really good i'm not saying this just to say it i don't get paid they probably don't even know who i am but when i appreciate something and i know that it's worth it i like to tell you guys about it so yeah i really hope that you guys enjoyed this video i know it's a long one it's a really good one i hope that you enjoyed thank you so much for watching and i will see you in my next one bye